Hello everyone and welcome back to a new video. My name is Spear and today I'll be returning back to Gary's Mod to show you once again on how to set up your sprays for in-game use. I did a similar video about this a few years back and despite the fact that the video did quite well in views, I've always thought I could improve on it and just make it look better overall. So today we'll be doing just that. How to set up your sprays on Gary's Mod plus extra. Be sure to leave a like or a comment if you found the video helpful. Alright, and let's get into it. Before we do anything, we require an image. Simply find an image that you want to use later and save it for later. However, make sure that the image you use is a JPEG, as PNGs will not work. As you can see here, these three images are all JPEGs. However, if we go over to Beans, you can see that it's a PNG. PNGs will not work properly when it comes to sprays. If you want to change a file from PNG to JPEG, you can open up something such as MS Paint or something similar. You open her up, you go to File, Open, you go to Beans, Me and the Boys at 2 a.m. looking for Beans, and then you go up to File, Save as Beans PNG. We're going to switch it to JPEG, and we're going to go Beans JPEG. Save, boom. We go back. And now we have a JPEG version of the file that we want to use. Once we have our images, we will open up Gary's Mod. Once in Gary's Mod, you will make your way over to the Options button and go over to Multiplayer. Here you'll see a button that says Import Spray. Click it. You will be shown this file directory. If we look up here in the Look In, you'll see a little bar here. And it's currently located in our D Drive, Steam Library, Steam Apps, Common, Gary's Mod. That's what's currently being shown in here. With this knowledge, we can now exit out of here. Go back to our file explorer and we will do some exploring. If we recall, it's located in our D drive, Steam library, Steam apps, common, Gary's mod, and voila! We are now in the same location that was just shown to us in Gary's mod. With this knowledge and with this file directory open, we can now go over to our memes, copy all of them, the ones that our PNGs can be removed. We can go Copy, boom, go back to the file directory in our D drive, hit paste, the images are now there, we will go back to Gary's mod, wait for that to show up, go to options, multiplayer, import sprays, and boom, beans, E, my original image, sat away, and time for crab are all here. Simply select the image that you want, hit open, and hit apply. Do this for all of your sprays. Open, apply, open, apply, open, apply. The reason why you want to do that is because in the drop down box here, you can quickly switch between them. Keep in mind that if you want to use your spray after switching it, you'll have to rejoin the server. Depending if the server actually allows sprays or not, will deter if you can actually can spray it down. Certain surfaces cannot be sprayed on, such as doors or movable objects. So try to use a floor or a wall if you can. If your spray for some reason doesn't show up or you can't seem to spray it down, it might be one of the following reasons. One is that you're in single player. Single player does not allow sprays to show up at all. You can spray them down, but you cannot see them. What? What the fuck? So I am in fact incorrect. You can spray down your sprays in single player. I'm not sure when they changed this, but I'll have to go off and uh, add this edit into the video. <laughs> Originally, it didn't work sprays just wouldn't show up. I think it, they would show that you sprayed it, but it was just invisible. So having this work now is uh, a bit confusing. Time to edit the video again about a video tutorial. I have to edit the video. Ugh. Number two is that the server you have joined has them disabled. Let's be honest. Some of the sprays that people put down can be uh, a bit sus. So the servers, depending if they're trying to make a profit or not, and if they're trying to be PG-13, might just outright disable them to avoid that factor completely. Number three. Your image just might be too large or too small. The maximum size of the image a spray can be is 512 kilobytes or in size ratio, I think the smallest is 256 by 256 and the largest is 4096 by 4096 in image size. Don't get me if I'm wrong, but I'm pretty sure that you can't have an image that's meant for ants, but you also can't have an image at the size of a football field. Number four. The surface you're spraying on isn't a sprayable surface. Things like doors, windows, breakable objects will not allow spray. The spray might go down, but the texture or the image might not show up. I recommend you spray the floor or the ceiling or some sort of unmovable surface for your spray to show up. Number five, 
Gmod just might be a bit broken. And depending on how long you've had Gmod installed for, you might need to do a fresh install. I've had to do a few in my years, and it did fix the problem. Not sure what the problem was to begin with, but if all else fails, you can always just do a quick install. And if that doesn't work, then I'm sorry, but uh, much like WebMD, I can't help you any further. It's gone, Terminal, and there is no going back. I'm sorry.